you in a bit. And in the Inland Empire, more problems. Trouble on the slick roads and with rising water, some drivers even had to be rescued. KKL News reporter Rena Nakano is live in DeVore near the 15 freeway with the very latest. Rena. Hey, Pat and Jeff, what I could tell you is that compared to the 4 p.m. newscast, the rain has gotten significantly stronger. Take a look behind me. This is the 215 and 15 interchange, and you could see that traffic is now bumper to bumper. Another thing we saw a lot of accidents and people needing some help. Damp, windy, and slick conditions proved to be challenging for drivers along Interstate 15 through the Cajon Pass Tuesday. Most drivers were taking it slow up toward the summit because the visibility was so poor. At around 11.20, we saw this overturned truck near the Oak Hill Road exit. The driver managed to get out, but the truck sat there with the windshield wipers still going. Just 20 minutes later, San Bernardino County Fire Swiftwater Rescuers arrived at Cajon Boulevard and Swarthout Canyon Road. An SUV driver was stuck after he tried to cross the Cajon Creek. They say he was able to climb out, but his car washed away about 100 yards downstream. He was later checked for hypothermia. The same crews then made their way downstream toward Keenbrook Road, where a semi-truck driver got stuck trying to drive through the same creek. The driver was able to climb out of the cab, but waited for crews to pull the truck out. And the moral of the story, I'm sure you can guess, San Bernardino County Fire did tweet this out. Turn around, don't drown. Live out here in Devore, I'm Rena Nakano, KCAL News. Really good reminder, Rena, thank you. Of course, it's been rough going as well as Orange County. Heavy rain there, strong winds pounding.